Wow, welcome to Playwatch. At the end of day five, some would say a boring draw. Um, there's been some entertainment, there's some, been some hard work, toil. There's also been some brilliance. Two players that we can talk about have been in the game for the majority of the game. All but 19 overs has Craig Brathwaite been in this game. A wonderful 50 to go with, uh, um, I think, uh, a man of the match effort, 100 in the first innings. His concentration powers were immense. His shot selection was fantastic. His shot execution was ably as good. And the way he performed, if it wasn't for Craig Brathwaite, I think England would have won this test match. Jack Leach, on the other hand, bowled 90 plus overs. I think the last person to bowl as many overs as Jack Leach was Fred Titmus in the 60s in India, in Indian conditions. And he's toiled hard, he's bowled well, bowled accurately. Some will question, has he got enough spin on the ball to create problems? There were turn out there, there was enough for him, I think, to take a lot more wickets than he did. But he came up against a fantastic customer in Craig Brathwaite. I thought he were, the way he was against Leach and the way he was in this test match, Brathwaite, did a lot to negate what Jack Leach had on offer as well as the rest of the England bowlers. So that's it, nil-nil, going to Grenada. Fingers crossed, we can't have another pitch like what we've just had. If it is, I'm going home after day one. We'll be no more player watch, because not only am I sick of my own voice, I'm sick of about saying the same things. Concentration, nutritional cricket, and very, you know, not much high sort of velocity and quality cricket. Until then, we'll see you that.